everyone. Uh, today we will be saving some leftover tomato uh, from yesterday's tomato salad and uh, we will uh, use it to cook a traditional uh, Turkish dish uh, that includes beans. So beans are excellent source of protein, they are also uh, plant-based proteins and could be a substitute to beef in the near future. If people start eating beans instead of beef, the effect would be huge. The livestock is responsible for a lot of greenhouse gas emissions and mostly in form of methane. So beef production accounts for 37 of human-induced methane being released in the air and methane is 23 times as warming as carbon dioxide. So part of the problem is also the use of land uh, to raise livestock and to feed it. Uh, that is the main reason for cutting down the trees around the world causing severe deforestation. So recently Amazon forests were cut down in Brazil for this purpose and Amazon forests as you know are called as the lungs of the earth. So shifting from beef to plant-based proteins could free up uh, for example only in the US 42% uh, of cropland reducing greenhouse gas emissions and decreasing deforestation. Uh, so let's cook our uh, dish uh, always remember you have to put any kind of uh, plant uh, protein uh, based uh, plant uh, based proteins into the water one day before you cook so I uh, put my beans beans or like that uh, like beans I, I uh, put one cup of beans yesterday into the water I drain it and now I will just uh, boil them in the uh, hot water for uh, 15 minutes it's almost done. Now I will drain them once more. Okay. Now I will uh, put two tablespoon butter. And we will put two uh, Two spoons of butter, two tablespoons of butter, and I will prepare for uh, one cup of uh, bean. Half onion will be enough. I will put uh, two peeled garlic and uh, tomato sauce. One tablespoon tomato sauce, tomato paste. So, okay, I put some, uh, let's say, hot sauce, uh, it's um, hot flavor sauce, and uh, one green onion, one green pepper, and I will chop the leftover, let's say, tomato. Down to let's put some salt, and, uh, some pepper, red pepper, And 
I will add the beans. And I will put water until it uh, covers all the la all the beans and close a lid. And I will uh, cook the beans for 20-25 uh, minutes with a medium heat, around four. Okay. Uh, while our beans are, let's say, getting cooked, we will. Uh, cook one cup of um, rice next to it. So I will uh, put um, two tablespoon butter. We will wait until the butter is melted. We will put our rice and we will roast it for five minutes together with the butter. And we will add the water. Uh, for one cup of uh, rice, we will add one and a half cup of water and some salt and we will cover a lid and wait for uh, 10 to 15 minutes after uh, until it absorbs all the water the rice absorbs the water so I'll Put the heat between two and three. So our beans and rice are ready, and uh, to make it more appetizing, uh, the beans to, to make beans more appetizing, uh, there are some foods uh, that are consumed together in uh, Turkish cuisine. Uh, for example, here uh, we have beans, and uh, we consume beans with rice, some uh, pickle, and uh, onion, white onion. So here is an example uh, of how we are serving. Our beans. Sprinkle some uh, dried mint, some pepper, red pepper, and we will serve uh, rice and beans together with some pickles and onion. They are all together are very delicious, and uh, they make uh, they are also increase the taste of the uh, beans, make it more appetizing. So today we saved our tomatoes. And uh, we also reduced our greenhouse gas emissions and protected our forests by consuming beans instead of beef. So please send me your questions about any kind of uh, food that you want to save from uh, going to waste. And thank you for watching this video. See you next week. Bye.